Hey, Happy New Year, everybody. Uh, this video is going to be a little random, I guess you could say. Uh, I went through all my old footage and I wanted to show you uh, some of my favorite clips, uh, some clips you may not have seen before, and just some cool shots. So I'm going to do some commentary over them. Enjoy. Now that minigun is hooked up to a car battery, and the funny thing is that so many people test fired it during the day that it ran out of power before it actually saw enemy. <laughs> Here's some shots of uh, the vehicles that get, we get to play with, these milsims. That's the tan vehicle, and this is the uh, greens vehicle. They are pretty badass, I gotta say. So this one here is probably my most commented clip. It's the uh, dick hit video. Some of you remember this one from my bloopers. Uh, this was actually from the first video I made that had multiple points of view. Oh, fucking hit right in the dick! Hit! Dick hit! Dick hit! <laughs> Back in! <laughs> Now this is one of my faves because uh, three guys sneak up to this bunker. I start shooting them. They're all yelling out in pain. One guy's even yelling my direction after he's dead. And uh, <laughs> I found that humorous. Dead man don't talk, but I mean, it, it was funny. <laughs> In this clip here, I find myself behind enemy lines. Um, I walk out right behind them and just basically take my pick at who I want to shoot. So during this ambush, somebody's hot micing. We're trying to figure out who it is, and it's not till our point man surrenders a guy that we realize it's him. Surrendered. Busted. Now, for those who have been following my channel a while, you probably know that I, I, I really like surrendering people. And uh, in this case, I wanted to see how close I could let this guy get to me before he noticed me and I'd have to surrender him. Uh, he actually gets pretty damn close. Surrender. <laughs> This one's a mixture of good and bad. Uh, the good is my ambush. Uh, the bad is kind of my reaction when I get hosed in the face at the end. <laughs> hit! 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 Jesus! Ah, it sucks getting hosed in the face, but no friends were lost. <laughs> Shit happens. Now this one you would have seen in my Nightfall 2 Hawkeye 1 Sniper Team video. So I just came in here, right? Yeah. Because the mortar just landed here, so you guys might be the only ones in here. <laughs> Alright. So if you heard what he just said, uh, the enemy mortared this kitchen. Uh, command sent us, the sniper team, just the two of us there, to try to hold it off until they could get more squads to come in and retake it. But uh, basically the referees, they're walking around, clearing out all of our team. Uh, the enemy stacked up right outside the doors, waiting for the referees to give them the go-ahead to say it's clear for them to come in. I guess the reason this is one of my favorite clips is I have dreams of moments like this. You're, you're the last man standing against the whole team, kind of pushing in. It wasn't their whole team, but it was 20 guys. And uh, my buddy there, Mr. Carrington, the sniper, he got hit right away, so it was literally me taking on 20 guys. It's pretty crazy. Send anyone you got into the fucking kitchen right now. Plus the fact that I was on the command channel so I could hear them panicking just trying to get everybody in here and I was like, all right, it's about to go down. Even the referees are like, we're getting the f*** out of here. That was the moment Mr. Carrington got shot and I'm like, uh-oh. You hit? Okay. I don't know if you just saw that, but the guy that popped out the door there shot all blanks. I was so lucky. I was trained on this other dude. The longer I can keep them out of this wing of the kitchen, the easier it's going to be for our team to get back to this position. So I'm just trying to hang in as long as I can. Ooh, I almost got hit there. <laughs> Which unfortunately isn't much longer than this point. Hit, hit, hit. 
Here's a clip from Nightfall 3. I rushed this bunker up here. There's a guy on the other side of it who uh, tries to pistol me. I end up shooting him right in both kneecaps, I think. It's uh, two good shots. Here we have a guy that's kind of hiding out down a hill. Uh, I decide to use the hill in front of me to my advantage, and I stand on top of it and get the uh, elevation he wasn't expecting. <laughs> this one? The sandbag. And this is one of those here. moments that you're uh, you're not expecting. Um, it ends well. Yeah. Uh, could have went worse uh, if we both opened Go fire on. on each other. But uh, yeah, there's a guy on the other side of this sandbag that pops out last second. I didn't know what to do. Oh, surrender! Technically, he had his gun pointed at me when he yelled mercy, so he got me. Uh, I just yelled it so we wouldn't hurt each other that close range. <laughs> Usually it's hard to find your grenades after you throw them unless you do this. I'd like to say I planned that, but not so much. It actually put a dent in my grenade. <laughs> and last but not least, uh, this is one of my favorite ones that was at the bunker. Uh, I got trapped in this room. Uh, the enemy are on both sides of the hallway. I can't get out of it. I have no ammo left in my AK, which you're about to hear because I'm going to shoot blanks at this guy. So now I'm down to my pistol. Uh, they definitely know I'm in here now, and this is when they start taunting. <laughs> <laughs> so my response to that was to shoot this first guy in the hall and then uh, pie the corner and shoot the guy next to him. I hear them talking about stacking up so I pop out and shoot the rest of them. And uh, yeah, that's what happens when you corner Coco and taunt them. <laughs> but anyways, hope you enjoyed the footage. Uh, Happy New Year and you're in for some good stuff this season and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.